Dark this Tony. It's what, sorry? Dark, isn't it? Look dark. Yes, it is a bit, it? Oh no it's not. I've got my sunglasses oh. on. Yeah. Uh, <laughs> well, I had exactly the same problem. I there was something wrong with this camera. Yes, well, I did as well. I couldn't understand why it was so dark. <laughs> <laughs> it's pretty ridiculous, isn't it? And that's before we've touched the Guinness. Yeah, absolutely. Come on, you're not giving me much of a performance. You go on, Carl. Go I said up. up there, then I can film you. Let's go. 
Think about the knights coming in, the consuls with the swords and the chain mail, and butchering the lollards who are in here praying. <laughs> butchering the heretics. I think it's a 20. Mine's a 26. You stop at 20. Mine's 26. We get fresh one. Wait! Soak of the atmosphere, you've got some ideas, oh, yeah. some, some thoughts on the matter. Yeah. Who are you in favour of? The constables or Sir William Lund? Walter. Walter, beg his pardon. The well known heretic. <laughs> I think he deserves it. Myself. The well known so, anti left footer. Yes. Can you make a story about it as well? Can you make a what? A story about it. Yes, you could do. <laughs> One night, and so Walter Lund. And his men got done by the constable. Can you write what it's like? Yes. You can write like it's like. Look, just look up at the sky there. Imagine how you, what it must have felt like when they had the soldiers coming in that end and there's no way of getting out. I suppose they sent soldiers down that end as well. And you tried to rush up there, there more than with swords coming down there. But there's nowhere to go. Once you're in here, you couldn't climb up the wall. I suppose you might have a go. Um, the they'd be pulling you down by the leg and sticking the swords in you. Oh, yeah, it's all very bloodthirsty, isn't it? Wait there a minute. Oh yes, there's all those Rachel's big drops at the yeah. what? Well done. Do Thank you. 